State University is very unique for many reasons. Not many HBCUs, let alone college campuses, can say they have their very own record label, but Delaware State can. Today we have Class Records joining us to celebrate their second annual talent show. Today we have our, their marketing director, Julian Smith, a.k.a. Solo, who's also a recording artist. Welcome, Solo. How you doing? I'm doing very well. I'm excited right. to have you back here. Mm -hmm. It's so hard to catch up with you between SYU and Class Records and you're doing the marketing and in the studies. We finally mm -hmm. caught up to the man of the hour himself. So tell us a little bit about why you came on the show today. Well, I came on the show to talk about Class Records. We have a talent show coming up December 2nd and it's only right that we got the beautiful Jamila to help promote it as well. <laughs> and I just feel that it's going to be a very well done production. Well, I'm excited. So before we go ahead and talk about the actual event, I want to deeper into a little bit about what exactly is your record label based off of? How many participants? How do you get signed? What is the bonus? Is it really like a record label or is it an organization that you guys come together and make good music? Well, Class Records is a student-ran organization record label and it's also a class. So many of the participants in Class Records are class students. I myself, I am not a music major, but I am a marketing director. So I am there to help promote. I'm there to make things happen, to put it in short terms. Now, there's artists along with myself that's on the record label. We do get in the studio and we make good music. We have a compilation that was done last semester. So we're looking for artists like myself, talented singing, rappers, poetry, anything of that nature is willing to come and be a part of the record label and make beautiful music. Now, do you have to be a Delaware State University student to participate in the record label? No, you don't. We like to base things off of Delaware State University because that's where we're located. Yes. But you don't have to go here. You don't have to attend here to be a part of Class Records. It's a record label. If you want to perform the um, talent show December 2nd, excuse me, right. that's open to the public. So I know somebody from Wilmington, he's a singer. He's coming down here just to audition, just so he could perform. And many other cases like that, is you don't have to be a Delaware State University student. Wow, okay, well, you know, a lot of people say that I've, I sing like Aaliyah. I don't know. <laughs> I remember <laughs> last year on the stage when I got up there and I began to sing uh, One in a Million. Everyone had booed me. Um, but I enjoyed being the host of Class Records. So leading into that, let's go ahead and let's talk about the show. So. One question that the students have been raving to know, okay, so. will it be a three to four hour show like <laughs> last year? Or uh, what did you guys plan as far as the outline of the show? Well, you know, last year it was a little long, but we got the organization down packed. We plan on it to be an hour and a half, most two hours. Wow. You know, structured 10 people performing, two backups. So we're going to have a good time. People are going to be entertain the whole night. Now last year you guys had a Sony of recording artists who came and blessed the stage mm -hmm. and the crowd went wild and it was awesome for, for not only just one reason but for two. One, you got a chance to see a female who was had a slight edge to her who can sing and rap and two, we were exposed to that professionalism at a mm -hmm. young age. Were you guys be bringing back a special performance or a special artist that the crowd can look forward to this year? Um, we are and talks about it. We're negotiating right now. The president's negotiating with Quilly Mills, an artist from Philadelphia. Wow. So they're going through that process. And also, if that doesn't work, it's also another singing group out there in Philadelphia named Brotherly Love 215. And they're ordered, uh, opening for Powerhouse tonight. Wow. So it's, we're looking to do big things. Well, you, I mean, you guys should. You are a record label. So <laughs> I'm so excited. So Give us a little bit about what we can specifically expect from the talent. Is it majority rappers, singers? Do you have some musical artists that might be doing an instrument? What can we expect from the diversity of talent? Well, I myself, I expect a broad range of talent. The auditions are November 3rd, 4th, and 5th inside the EH. So once that One more time, hate to cut you off. Hey, hey. Go ahead. Repetition what are those is audition, key. <laughs> what are the audition dates for Delaware State it's as well as outside students? 3rd, 4th, and 5th inside the EH choir room. It's going to be 7 o'clock. So I'm just going to say that. And that is November. November. So this is next week. This is next week. Awesome. We caught you at a perfect time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, continue. So for the auditions, what do they need to bring? What is the length? Um, is it no cursing? What are the regulations to participating in this event? We are, you know, on campus. Keep the cursing very limited to none. Um, <laughs> bring in your 
music. If you play your instrument, bring that in. If you sing, just bring your vocals. If you have a beat that you sing into, bring that. If you rap, have some material. Um, you you could just do an acapella, and then when your time comes, rehearsal time, bring your full product. So I'm super, just be ready I'm, to wow us or wow <laughs> the people that's going to be judging you to see if you can make it. Well, I'm amazed already. I know that uh, last year, Shannon and myself, we got a chance to host, which was mm -hmm. awesome. You guys had a wonderful judge panel, so I'm looking forward to that. How can students, if they want more information on joining the org or even coming to show love and support your event, how can they go ahead and follow Class Records? Well, number one, when you see me, holla at me. I have information that's just, just ask me. I'm going to point you in the right direction because I believe in helping my brothers and sisters. Come to the meetings, 2 o'clock, no, excuse me, Tuesdays, Tuesdays. 7 o'clock, <laughs> inside the EH 141. That's every Tuesday. So you're going to see Mr. Denson, Dr. Tolly. You're going to see the president. You're going to see myself, other artists in there, and we're all just planning and grinding. Social media. Social media. You can follow us on Instagram at Class Records. All right, well, there right. you have it. Class Records, Inc. Thank you. All right. Thank you, Solo. <laughs> um, he's an excellent music, music artist, so don't forget to stop by at 7 p.m. on Tuesdays if you want a little bit more information. If not, we'll see you at the show. Mm -hmm.